A more than 100 year old church in Miami's Overtown neighborhood has been saved. CBS News Miami's Tanya Francois is here to explain why saving this church was more than just about dollars and cents, right, Tanya? That's right, Elliot. Churches are usually where people go to be saved. This time, it was the church that needed saving, and it was city officials who used their power and their dollars to do just that. You have to maintain your history. And this church, uh, from the time Thetford Johnson was the pastor up until recently, was a beacon of hope for the people in this community. James McQueen says the St. John Institutional Missionary Baptist Church used to be his playground growing up. The church sits in the heart of Overtown on 3rd Avenue and Northwest 13th Street. So when the church fell into financial hardships due to a bad mortgage taken out by a now former pastor, it was a woman whose last name happens to be King, who he worked with. Well, this is one of the oldest churches in this community. and. It was established in 1911, and to lose this church would be a setback. Christine King is a Miami City Commissioner and heads the CRA. This property would have sold to developers or whoever who don't care about the community and the uniqueness of this neighborhood. Three million dollars is what it cost to save the parking lot and the church's two nearby buildings. The church itself was never at risk, except one of the entrances is through that very parking lot. McQueen says the future of Overtown depends on keeping its history preserved. I remember this as a vibrant community, and I watched it destroyed. And now? And now, if you look around, you can see that Overtown is on its way back. So the church will have to pay the $3 million back, and the CRA says they will work with church administrators to make sure they can meet those terms. In the studio, Tanya Francois, CBS News, Miami. Good to see it staying right where it is, Tanya. Thank you.